Hey everyone, Zero Jada here with the XBLA Fans channel. I'm here to give a quick taste of Bone Marrow, a sort of puzzly game where your job is to defeat the evils that have risen from the darkness. Uh, so I have played a few matches of this and uh, I've actually gotten decently far by just spamming directions. I haven't beaten the first like area yet, but I've actually gotten pretty far. I actually got to like, I think the boss, uh, but here's the store. Story, not the store. But yeah, so, uh, as you can see at the bottom left, you actually have my level. Next to that is my health. Left is my like uh, sort of attack and right is my defense. And the entire point of this game is to sort of match up these uh, items here. And then during the uh, day, collect them and fight off any evils that might uh, come on in. There we go. So uh, a level two has to be level matched with a level two to make a level four. And then two level fours make an eight. Eight and eight is 16. You get the idea. So let's see what we got here. So I've actually gotten pretty far by just randomly hitting directions in this game. Okay, so now I can go collect stuff. As you can see at the bottom, that's the day and night cycle. Yeah, here's Scarecrow. Oh, I died. Wow. I did not. I have not encountered a Scarecrow before. Whatever. I don't like that it rolls through the entire... Uh, uh, dev logo every single time. Yes, we know. All right, let's go. So there's that. Match those up. I got some of that. Match those. I really need to get my health out of the uh, negatives. Or like not being so low. Get those shields together. Swords up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Much better. So let's go through here. It's perfect. I got set some good health really early on. Uh, so I believe as your crown level or your level goes up, you get more and more health. And I think that's just essentially by score or surviving. I'm not 100% sure. Like I said before, I got pretty far with just hitting random directions. And this is just literally me hitting the D-pad. Here, I got some health. There's a rat somewhere. Uh, so what's interesting is when you start, like, fighting skeletons and stuff, they actually start to collect the items on the board, which uh, can make your life kind of difficult at times. There we go. Got some health going. Also, your character looks different as you collect more goodies. It's fun. Always like care, uh, games that like even in, like mostly in RPGs like when you equip something different, it actually looks different on your character. I did uh, when I was playing like my very first game. Literally, I had uh, like three hundred shields before I got to level three. It was really crazy. Combine those two. Uh, so yeah, I'm essentially, if I see a match next to each other, I'm just kind of going for it. Got those two level fours there. Nothing really to go for here. Get those. There we go. Perfect. Always make a beeline for the uh, nicer. There we go. Here's a skeleton. Luckily, I have a big old chunk of, uh, yeah, it's defeating enemies. Combine those. Combine those. Uh, achievements in this game aren't too difficult. It's uh, getting a certain amount of score, uh, getting a shield to 16, getting a sword to 16, getting uh, food to 16, which after a while, if you're just, like I said before, while you're randomly hitting stuff, will happen. Like that one's already eight, and it's, again, not terribly hard. Always go for the uh, big stuff first. And stuff just literally will pile up. Like, I almost have... I have 158 shields. Or defense. Which is pretty nuts. Buy those swords. There we go. And I have full health, so I'm fine for now, but... 
get some in there. I just gotta be careful because if the skeleton comes in, I gotta roll up in there and make sure that he doesn't get it. Perfect. Oops, uh, there we go. Nothing to combine. I love to get these two shields together. Oh, there's a level eight uh, sword. Ooh, more. So I got to level six when I first played and uh, that's when the big old, and I'm guessing it's like the skeleton king because he had a big old uh, crown on him. There are achievements for defeating certain enemies like a rat, skeleton. Uh, there's one for defeating a snake, which I haven't seen, even seen yet. Combine those two. I'm guessing those are papayas or no, maybe those are peaches. I'm not sure. I'm a hero. I don't need to know. Yeah, once in a while, it'd just be like, it'll just throw a rat at you and be like, yeah, free kill. But yeah, during the night is when you kind of uh, do this. If an enemy is still alive when it becomes night, you can't actually attack each other. There we go. There's a 16 shield. I got it. And of course, here, I'll show an example. Like, look how much shield I have. And now we're just going to tap through this. Bam. Oh, there's another 16 shield. I don't know. I've never had it so where I've had two 16s next to each other. So I don't know if they can go higher. Get rid of the rat. I've also had times where I've like just one hit skeletons because I had so much uh, damage. Hmm. Like again, I'm really am just kind of tapping until I see a match. Get that rat. I I've, I have again 250 shields. It's ridiculous. I'm essentially just a medieval tank at this point. And of course, each hit lowers your uh, attack values. Come on. Once uh, you can... I mean, come on, are you gonna... No, he's not gonna... See, okay, so you saw that he picked up some goodies there. They were supposed to be my goodies. All right, got some level fours. All right, come on. Dang it, I was trying to see if I could get those two fishes together. I don't think the rats can pick up swords. They're not skeevers. Not skeever, uh, no. What are they called from, um... Warhammer. Skeevers are, uh, uh, Elder Scrolls. But yeah, this is, this is a, oops, I wanted to combine that food. Uh, the boss I faced had like 200 health and I, I had barely scratched through, uh, survived the, uh, for the encounter before him. Just punch on this dude. Come on, we got this. It is really worthwhile to actually try to match these. But again, I, I said before, I got really far by essentially not really doing that. Oh, there's a 16 sword over there. We're going for it. Oh boy. He has so much health. It is nice that they kind of operate off the same terms that you do. And since no one can move, we're just going to punch each other until it's over. Get a C. 
16 health shield. Get rid of that rat. I wonder if I wanted to, I could just keep that rat alive. Ooh, there's a 16 sword over there. Look at my armor change, because I leveled up. We got this. So this is about the same spot that I was uh, when I first played. The second time I played, uh, uh, didn't work out too well. And then you saw what happened the next time. I like that they once in a while just throw a rat at you. It's like, yeah, that is a, a break. Take it. Get that. Get that shield there. Excellent. Perfect. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So we got an eight sword there, and I'm doing pretty decently for uh, armor still. Oh, give me another wrath. That's good. Dang it, I was trying to get that armor. But I think you get the idea. I am Zero Jetty. This is the x Fans channel. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, ask down below. Goodbye, everyone.